Welcome to the AIMED 9 product demonstration. AIMED is an all-in-one practice management and EMR solution for the small to medium-sized medical facility. I've got AIMED open at the provider list. This is what you would see when you first log into AIMED as a provider. We're going to work with Casey who's coming in for chest pain. I've selected a template for chest pain. I've had AIMED include my letterhead logo and I've also brought in an image from a previous visit. I'm going to demonstrate how easy it is to use the note section of AI Med. It's really flexible. Here we've got drop down menus, the ability to type directly into the note, to use handwriting recognition with a tablet, or speech recognition through the Dragon Engine. Anywhere you place your cursor in the note, you can type, talk, handwrite, or use your preset drop down menus. I'm going to do a little bit of everything. Let's start with chief complaint, so I'll click on that. Casey's coming in for chest pain. The chest pain is located in the chest. The duration is one week. Now you've seen there I've clicked on top of each item to bring up the menu. However, you can also use your tab key. Let's do that for the rest of this HPI. I'll tab to quality. I'll use my arrows and we'll say the pain is sharp. I'll tab to severity and we'll come down and do a seven. I'll tap next to modifying factors and we'll say general and then we'll say no other signs or symptoms. Now if I wanted to type I can actually hit my spacebar and type as well. You can also type in the middle of any sentence. Let's come up here and say the patient states they've had chest pain for the past week and we're going to say the pain is described as sharp and at times is rated as high as a 7 out of the pain scale with no other comments. So you can type anywhere you would like in the note. You'll see other items have come into the note automatically. The problem list carries forward, so do the allergies. Vitals would come in when your medical assistant or nurse enters them based on the same date of service as the note. Current medication also carry forward and can be entered real time. All this information can be carried forward if you put a marker in your template. Again, since this is a word style template, you can do whatever you want for the look and feel of it. Let's go down to the assessment. All the ICD codes are preloaded and can be searched by name or number. Let's type in chest pain and see what we get. There are three codes that match that. Notice how I don't need to know the beginning of the description, just any word within the description itself will find it. So we'll choose 78650. I'll just add one diagnosis code and save that. Next let's go to the plan part and we'll return Casey in one month when it comes to labs or diagnostics, with the lab engine, we work with Quest and LabCorp. It's built into AI Med already, and it is a full send and receive system with alerts if something's abnormal. With the diagnostics, you can create output forms, or if you'd like to be connected to radiology or a hospital, that's an option as well through the HL7 engine. When it comes to the medication, AI Med does have a medication engine built in. You can drop to paper you can fax or you can send electronically through our SureScripts integration. Let's go ahead and do that now. All the medication are built in and these are some frequently used SIGs here. With the medication there are drug to drug and drug to allergy alerts, formulary alternative, dosing recommendations and SureScripts will even tell you via a message if the patient picks up the medication, requests a refill, or is already on that medication. So let's go ahead and add the amoxicillin to the note and that will send it automatically over to SureScripts or drop it to paper or fax depending on what you select. Now you see the amoxicillin is in the note. And that's really it. Within a minute or two you can do a follow-up pretty quickly and as far as new notes go I don't have things in this template for review of systems, physical, neurological, or past histories, but there are markers where you can add that information into the note as you see fit, depending on the template you're using. 
We do have a full document management system. So if you would like to have things brought into the note like I did for the x-ray here, you can. You can drag them in from sections like x-rays, EKGs, patient pictures, or you can bring them in from a disk or download them from a hospital or radiology if you have access to them. You do have the ability to draw on the image as well. We do have a full document management suite built into the EMR. Once you're done with the note, clicking the e and coder will open the e and coder and ask you how much time you've spent. Now if you don't want to use the e and coder, it can be turned off. Here you can see it's suggesting a 99213, so I'll accept that. Next, the super bill is going to open. AI Med comes with super bills built in for each specialty. However, they're fully customizable. And you can have a super bill for each provider if you have a multiple provider or multiple specialty practice. Notice how the 99212 has come in already. I can also insert additional things if I needed to. Let's go ahead and do a B12 and then I'm going to apply that. When you click apply, that's going to close the note, take you back to your patient list and change the status to a C for completed. That will pass all the information onto the billing engine automatically so your biller only has to review then upload a print depending on what they'd like to do. It also passes the information up to the scheduling engine for any of your orders, labs, and additional printouts for things like patient education. That concludes our demonstration of AI Med 9. If you would like to do a full product demonstration, which is web-based and interactive, please call our office at 800-403-2330 to request a demonstration. Thank you very much for taking the time to review the AI Med 9 web demo.